Hello there and welcome back to Milk It Reviews. For those of you who have seen the other reviews that I've done of um, 511 sunglasses, right, you'll know that I have to have good quality sunglasses. My eyes are very, very sensitive to bright sunlight. Not that we get much of it here in the UK, but when we do, right, it really does right, um, take its toll. But on top of that, we've got the other side of it. We also need protection, so that sometimes rules out the use of normal mineral glass safety um, sunglasses, right, which I always used to wear. Right, then along come 511, right, coupled up with Wiley X, right, and they started producing this mixture of two. Right, now my first pair of tactical glasses, right, were in fact Wiley X SG1s. They were great, they were a little bit clunky, right, the fact that they fitted too tight to the eyes made them mist up like crazy, right, which really caused a few problems for me. Um, so, you know, it was just looking out for something that was different. As you probably gathered by now, got a lot of 511 kit, love it to death. Right, as soon as Wiley X and uh, 511 teamed up and started producing these range of glasses then, that really captured my attention in a massive way. A little bit of a sneak preview here, right, it's nothing top secret, if it was I wouldn't know about it. Right, I saw on 511's website the other day, right, and it was literally such a quick snippet, right, it was on there and then off, in next to no time. It looks like 511 will be producing tactical ballistic glasses in prescription form. Right now, exactly how it's going to work, I've got no idea. It was just something I found on their website. When I went back the next day to have another look at it, it had gone. Right, um, I must admit, I'm starting to wonder whether I imagined it or not, right? But the thought would be a very nice thing. So keep your eyes peeled, right? If I find out, I'll pop up a quick video on it, right? Hopefully, with my prescription tactical ballistic glasses, right? But we'll have to wait and see because we don't know anything at all about it. But let's go to the ones that we've got in, in here for you today. This is the Raid Eyewear. Been about a while in the 5M range. Don't really know why I didn't select these previously. I like the ones with interchangeable lenses. I mean, here you've got the um, the plain smoke lenses, right? And believe me, they are dark, right? They're very dark, right? They allow light transmission of 15%, right? Now, that's absolutely perfect for me, right? Um, I've got to say that with the, the shape of the, the lenses in these glasses, right, they, so they, they're curved in two directions. They don't cause any form of optical distortion, right, um, which is an absolute must, right, for quite a few of us, right. We've got to make sure that what we see is what we're actually looking at. Right, you've also got the, the clear lenses, so if you're using these at night, Right, you could pop those in. Those allow 89% of light transmission. And also the ballistic orange, or as we call here in the UK, the amber lenses. Um, and those allow trans light transmission of 53%. Right, um, the lenses change very easily. Right, let's just cover the frames first. Right, on the inside of the arms, right, and also the nose piece is a very soft rubberized material which hold these nice and firmly in place without being uncomfortable. I have got a head like a medicine ball. I'll take a size 62 centimeter, I only said inch then, 62 centimeter helmet, right, um, right, and I have flex in any type of glasses to me is very important. They never make them big enough for my suite of a head, right, um, but these, when they're on, they're perfectly comfortable, wear them all day long, no problems at all. Right, changing the lenses, absolute piece of cake. Right, just take hold of the nose bridge piece and also the top of the lens, pull them apart, right, and just pop the corners out. There it is. Right, now to remove the nose piece, we literally just get hold of one of these and just move it in and it rolls out. Right, let's take that out, let's pop the ballistic orange in. Right, we can pop that in now, so in reverse, right, that's popped in. And then when you're putting them back in, you put the ends into the frame first. They just slot in, right, they've got a hook on the end there of the actual lens. Right, those just hook in. Right, do the same with the other end. And it goes. Right, and then squeeze the top of the frame down. I've never actually fitted these lenses to these frames before, but they just push down, make sure there's no 
light coming through between the top of the frame and the actual lens itself and there you have it right the quickest lens change I think I've ever had now in addition to just the 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 glasses the frames of the, the lenses <coughs> nice touch right when you buy this sort of configuration from 511 you get the whole kit right you've got the the retaining lanyard right with the rubberized tips on the ends that fit on the arms one thing that I've done with these I've got three pairs of 511 glasses I've done it with all of these this adjuster will pull straight off the end of the the neck cord so what I've done I just double the end of the neck cord over and just put two or three stitches along it just to create a lump so that adjuster doesn't come off anymore right it's just a handy little tip right it just stops you losing it right um, but that solves that right you've got two um, pouches these double up as a microfiber lens cloth which is fantastic right got one to take the glasses themselves if you're not wearing them all the time they can pop in there that's taking care of the glasses for you and you've got this other one which is for the lenses now the great thing about these you know, I don't know as clearly you see that you've got a separate piece of material runs right down the inside there so you've effectively got two pockets so you can drop your spare lenses into separate compartments in the same lens carrier right and they're not going to rub together and get scratched which I think is just a nice little touch right so that you're going to be able to keep hold of your glasses right for many many years to come right and they're going to stay in good condition on top of that single slick stick attachment quite solid case I mean I'm, I'm quite happy to leave my glass inside there you've got a cord in there which you can adjust by just changing the position of the knot of how far that comes out right and all of this right including your spare lenses excuse me a minute right all fits together in the one pouch there you go job done so you've got everything you need all in one pouch which will attach nicely to your belt to your webbing wherever you want to keep it or just simply kept in your bag right that's the radar I wear from 511 if it's your first time to milk it reviews you know I'll keep hoping on about this please subscribe I've got a load more videos coming up in the future right um, some nice new kit that I've uh, got out and gotten well maybe there'll be a review of my divorce soon right because I've got too much kit kicking around like probably most of you have out there right um, but it's just the way that it goes right um, please feel free to ask any questions you may have right I'm only a message box away right and we'll see if we can find your answers but watch this space and please subscribe thanks for watching bye bye